up guys it's your boy young stud ryan hold on let me scoot closer also known as ryan that's my name just call me feel free to call me ryan so oh desk is squeaking um so i did a tutorial over twitch and youtube overlays and now people are asking what about your twitch panels like how do you do that so i'm, I'm coming here today i'm coming here today as a g you know i'm, I'm the og I'm not that cool, but I'm going to teach you how to make your own panels, and if you ever have any trouble, just message me, I, or say something down in the comment like, yo, what can I do, I'll give you some, you know, I'll give you some eyeballs, you know, so anyways, to start your panels off, you want to start your width at 320, and your height at 100, I always use pixels, pixels are just a good look, and then your background, you want transparent, you click OK, and first thing before you ever start, I don't care, you, you grab your ruler. If you don't, on the real, you want me to be honest with you? If you don't use your ruler, you're a little bitch. Why? Because measuring to the perfect inch is the best. And whether we do the best of our job or the best of our abilities right now, it don't matter. Probably throw it about right there. I'm going to throw one in the middle. I'm going to teach you how to make a cool ass, cool ass. I did this for uh, some uh, some girl. Shout out to her. If she ever watches this, she probably never will. Who cares? Who cares if she ever watches this? That's not even. That's even correctly even. All right. So you come over here. You grab your pen tool. We're gonna make a trace around this. Click dots, and then right here's the tricky part. You just come somewhere over here like this. Hit it right there. Come back. Boom. 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 Right click, you want to fill path, and black. Right click again, you want to delete the path. If I'm going too fast, just know you are the ones who can pause the video. I can't just pop. Okay, I can't pause the video. You're the ones who can pause the video. I was going to do a pause effect, and then I looked over and saw a spider, and I was like, wait. There's a spider. There's actually a spider. Should I smack it? I'm gonna smack it. No, actually I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna call it Charlotte. Hi Charlotte. I'm Young Stud. I'm just doing a tutorial on YouTube. Okay, that's not weird at all. Alright, so I didn't even tell y'all what type of panel we're gonna be making. We're gonna be making a Twitter panel. Anyways, remove your uh, rulers after you get that done. Not all your rulers, just your basic Keep your basic four. You always keep your basic four rounded around the edges. And so, here's my Twitter logo I'm going to be using today. This is my Photoshop folder. Y'all can literally go make you a folder on your desktop, all your Photoshop designs. And so I grabbed a Twitter, a little Twitter picture. Make sure you want to grab one with no background, none at all. I'm going to teach y'all how to do that real quick. So, you come over here, you click search tools on Google, color, transparent. Booyah. Come back. Where's that picture? I just had it on a picture I really liked. Oh well. Oh well. Oh well. So you grab that. Then you want to hold shift while you drag it. So it keeps it in proportion. Make it better. Oh! Control Z. We fixed it. I was like, damn, did I really just fuck up on my own tutorial? That looks big enough. Now nah, we make it a tad smaller. We make it just a tad. There we go. Right click. Place it. First of all, we're not going to put it on there yet. So layer right here, we're going to go to blending options on the black. You want to go to color overlay. You want to make that the Twitter blue. Why? Because this is going to look cool in the end. You want to change that. You want to put a stroke on it, make it have a little outline so it knows that's the boundary. Come over here to the Twitter logo, blending options, color overlay, bust out that black. Baya. No, that's not even a sharp black. Get dark ass black. Like a... Uh, Young Stud Ryan Black, you know what I'm saying? I come over here, or uh, Young Thug Ryan in his videos. You want to go with the deep, baby. Alright, so anyways, we got that. So to create a badass background, you want to make a new layer. Grab your paint can, make sure it's on black. BAM! Move that to the back. There you got your background. Not quite yet. You want to come over here, search something cool on Google. I searched trippy backgrounds, I looked through it. I'm going to try to find the one I found real quick. 
looking through, looking through. I found a really cool one. I already saved it. I just wanted to show y'all that I found it on here so it didn't look like I was cheating. Cheating myself, at least. Um, right here. This one. That, I'm, I'm not even sure if that's even it. I'm 100% sure that's actually it, though. So you come over here. You got it in your folder. Let's look for it real quick. It's right here. That was it. Hold your shift button down. Let's make this hella giant. I. Right. Now, after you got that all giantly fixed up, you want to come over and find a cool little spot. So let's just get like a random out blast of just everything. Place that. That doesn't even look that cool, to be honest. If you want me to be 100% honest, you can do a lot better. I've done a lot better. It's just, in the end, it's going to look dope. So you want to change your opacity to that picture. You want to make it a little lighter. Okay. Come over here, grab your pencil. Bam, let's type it. Twitter. Come here. Center it up. Right click on your Twitter. You want to stroke. Make it where you can read it a little better. And voila, you got yourself a nice little Twitter panel. Therefore, you come over here to your thing. Let's type in twitch.tv. Boom, we got young stud Ryan already up in this bitch. And then you uh, literally come down here and you upload it. You upload it, and they will look. So, well, I mean, they're not gonna look exactly like that, but it's gonna it's gonna be the same concept as if you added anything else. You know what I'm saying? All right, dudes. Boom. That's how you make a panel for your Twitch live stream. If you need any help with it, anything with designs, any recommendations say some things in the comment i will definitely comment on everybody that has questions thank you dudes like this video all my links will be in the description come check me out live stream sometime ask me be like or no don't ask me tell me be like dude i saw your video over the panels you know dog i like that i like that shit or if you don't like it you can tell me that too i probably just be like oh i mean i just try to show you a tutorial you can do better you don't have to use the background on the real that looks sick enough but Ooh, one more thing. One more thing before we go. Check this shit out. Start another layer. Grab your paint can. Blue. Okay. Bam. Right click. Change the opacity on that. That looks cool. Actually, right click on that. Let's move this all the way up. Okay. You can do stuff like that. Just play around. You guys get the concept. I'm going to get out of here. Make sure to like, subscribe for more, and definitely comment below if you need any help. Thank you, dudes. I love y'all, and peace out.